hello there. How we doing today? This is Nate. Hope you guys are having a blessed day today. And today we are at uh, Centennial Homes, Bismarck, North Dakota. We're looking at this uh, three bedroom, two bath, single wide. This one is, uh, once again, one on the entry level side. This is a long home, so you still got lots of space in this home, even though it is a single wide. Not a lot to show on the back side here. We'll be real brief here. There's gonna be your back door. So this one does have a little bit of a unique floor plan. Something I haven't seen before in a single wide. I'm sure you're gonna wanna see the way it's laid out. Those of you that are interested in single wides and looking to purchase one. So go ahead and head on in and uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Just like most single wides, the first thing you see when you come in, front door is your uh, living room area. Now there are no overhead lights in your living room area. Maybe something you can option in to have a center light or something like that. Otherwise you just have switched outlets to turn your lights on. Overall, I mean, you've got a decent sized living room area. But as you can see, it's pretty wide open. Kitchen, dining room, living room kind of all blend together, so to say. It's still in your dining room area. Plenty of room for a table for four. This is something I've never seen before. Usually your back door is in the middle of the hallway that goes down to the kids room. So right off your back door here is going to be your utility room. Since we're right here, if you want to call it a utility room, it's going to be where your washer and dryer are at. Like I said, usually all this is down the middle of your hallway. Now your kitchen area, got the nice dark cabinets, something I really like. You get stainless steel Whirlpool appliances. Now there is not a lot of cabinets in here though. And I think with the lack of cabinets, you get a nice window right here though of your sink. Seeing how there's a lack of cabinets, I think I'd almost like to see another one right up there, even though it is a little bit harder to reach. There's going to be your furnace and your water heater back behind that. So you have a little bit of storage space there, but not a lot. You know, when you get a single wide, you usually have to sacrifice a few things that you wouldn't have in your double wides. In this case, it's a cabinet space. But I think I would probably, if this was my home, I would put in a cabinet right there of some sort, maybe. Add a little more storage space. Down here is going to be all your bedrooms. Like I said, a little bit different than normal. Because your front door is at the right at the entranceway to the hallway. So 
So bedroom number one. Now mind you, these front bedrooms are always the smaller of the two bedrooms. And you got double shelves in here. Now they are the wire racks. Just fine for being a entry level single wide. As you can see, it is board and bat all the way throughout the home. One piece shower tub combo. Standard sink area in your bathroom. Hello, Raiden. Guess I didn't catch myself all that well, but that's about the time he's gonna quit watching anyway. I wave to him. He'll watch the video up till about that point, and then he'll go back to watching his Power Rangers or his uh, other videos that he always watches. I think one of his favorites right now is, is I guess, this guy called Dan TDM on YouTube. You'd think that I would be his favorite, but no. Dad just does videos about homes. Dad doesn't do any video game plays or anything like that on YouTube. That's what he likes to watch, is guys playing video games of these games that I've never heard of. I guess one of his favorites that he likes to watch videos of now is a, some game called Among Us or something like that. Can't say I've ever heard it or seen it other than what uh, I see when he's watching the videos himself. So you got a decent sized master bedroom though. Still got recessed lighting, which I forgot to point out all throughout the house is recessed lighting. And ladies, you've got your makeup area there, albeit the mirror is kind of in the wrong spot. So you probably have to add yourself another mirror right there. Is a one piece shower tub combo in your master bathroom, also. Of course, now, it's just me. Seems how there's a tub at the other end. I would probably go with tile shower there if I could. And then your closet's going to be over here. Now it is wire racks in the closet. You get the dual shelves. But I think I would probably option in another one right there. Possibly a second one to go across there. And seeing how there is no door right there, I'd probably put one in myself if I couldn't get one as an option. Not necessarily a swinging door, but maybe one of those... Uh, accordion style doors to put in there that way you can kind of close off the closet and have its own space there so a few minor changes that I would like to see in the home but other than that this is a really nice home I do like it wide open layout here and if you like that wide open layout don't forget to go down there and hit that like button. While you're down there, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications so you get notified every time I upload a video. Currently uploading three times a week. Every Monday, excuse me, every Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday. I don't know where Monday came in from. I've never uploaded on Monday. 
So I will see you in the next one and you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.